block a guy to my right. Instead of stepping block. straight ahead, I'm going to step at him now. I'm going to open that toe a little bit and try to get my head in front. Okay? So if I'm down blocking to my right, it's just jab, stick, head in front, pin him with that top elbow so he can't spin out, and keep our head in front to keep him from penetrating across the line. Because usually when we down block, there's some kind of pull coming from the other direction, right? So we don't want that guy getting up field, getting in our puller's way. Okay, so head in front, jab, stick, and then we drive him at a 45, kind of towards the sideline, at a 45 degree angle, so to speak, okay? It's not an exact 45 degree angle, but we want to drive him that direction, okay? And then same thing if I was going white, just jab, open the toe, stick, square my hips up, pin with that elbow, Hand again on that far hip, and then drive. No, it's all the same thing, just that first step is in a little bit different direction. Hey guys, that first step, <coughs> the coach was doing, if you notice, he came out of that first step. That first step, then we got out of his stance, okay? So a lot of young linemen will do this and stand up. And once you stand up, here's what's gonna happen. If you stand up, if I'm a, uh, say I'm a, a, white, a white guard, a left guard, if I'm, if I'm, say I got a nose man here, if I'm down blocking, if I stand up, these guys are going to read that on defense. If you try to clear this guy, he's going to knock you over. You have a better chance of doing getting your down block, getting the shoulder up here. If he hits you from up here, it's not going to affect you as much as you can just bounce over your 